it is such a major thing in the poetry industry? Well, in the layers poetry industry that I am majoring in. So I just want to talk about the feeds I have used so far during my two year yeah two years already two years of managing a layers poetry farm yeah that's what this video is about today hello guys hello 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 welcome to my channel my name is modupe if you're seeing my face for the first time i am a poetry youtuber based in lagos nigeria and if you're a returning subscriber thank you for stopping again so today is just like a story time uh not really a story time just i just want to tell you about the feats i have used so far um during my two years of managing the poetry farm so i started managing this poetry farm in march of 2022 yes and this is this is like two years after so this is not any way of advertising for any for any feed brands or this is just me talking about my personal experience at my farm all right so the first feed we used on this farm when we started was hybrid we were using hybrid grower because the birds we got at that farm at the time were they were 16 weeks so we started with hybrid grower and it was it was okay it was fine then of course as the birds started laying eggs we changed to hybrid layer mash so we started using hybrid layer mash and we used hybrid layer mash from let's say april of 2022 we used it till august of 2022 so we have to stop using hybrid because <laughs> how am i going to say this anyway we stopped using hybrid uh we weren't getting what we wanted at the farm at that time so we changed to new hope we started using new hope a new hope it's our money in all honesty i i am i am such a big advocate of new hope so if anybody works at new hope you better come and contact me to come and be your influencer or something but anyway their feed is amazing they have a, a very good range of products that you can buy from that you can use at your farm and being a a business that is technology driven they are able to key into that they gave us when we were using new hope we had the best results at this farm the best result and we used new hope from august of 2022 to october of 2023 so we used the feed for over a year amazing time good production we're having excellent percentages but in june of 2023 the price of feed started going up up crazily and new hope being i think it's probably one of the most expensive feeds in the country in nigeria at the time how much were we buying new hope i started buying new hope at six thousand maybe six thousand eight hundred and when we're buying that for every 40 bags of feed you buy from, because i buy from the company for every 40 bags of feed you buy you get one bag free good deal you know so we're buying that i think at that time when we started we're buying 120 bags of feed and we'll get three bags free so eventually they re they removed that one bag extra and they okay they reduced the price by 100 naira and removed one bag which wasn't even a good deal for us farmers trust me but anyway that was what happened then of course price started increasing anyway in june of last year when the price of um feed started going up across all the feed companies when it got to october we were tired we could not deal with it anymore at that time i think the last price i got new hope was like nine thousand something i know at the moment is probably over thirteen thousand naira. it's crazy maybe fourteen thousand naira even i've not bought it in a long time so we had to start checking asking questions what other feed can we use what other feed can we use i was talking to people anyway we settled for breed well breed well feed i think is um breed well feed is made by Said. Said um company they are in ibadan yeah okay i don't know where hybrid is from because when we're using hybrid we we buy from a distributor but when we start using new oak we're buying directly from the company and breed well also we bought directly from the company at Zibadon. So we'd have to get higher trucks that'll bring it to the farm. 
which was a good deal. Then breed well. We used it for some time. We only, I think we only got two, two. We only bought breed well like twice. Then we had to change the feed again because of course their price too was side going up. We we had to we switched to breed well because the price was a lot better. Was cheaper rather, not better. Was cheaper than new op at the time. Then of course it affected our production. I think my birds were just used to new op feed and they started doing nonsense for me when we were using breed well. So I just had to change it because I wasn't getting, I wasn't happy with what was happening with the with the results I was getting. Maybe I was wrong, but <clears throat> it is what it is. Then we changed the feed. So right now I am using livestock, livestock um, premium layer mash. That's what we use at the farm at the moment. And of course, <clears throat> this is like how many, how many times have I brought livestock now? I think I've gotten the feed like uh, three times. And in the period of three months, the difference in the price is, is over, is over 3,000 Naira in three months. This video is not to teach you anything. <laughs> it's just to tell you the feeds I have used so far. I hope that things get better eventually. Maybe things normalize with the way the price of feed is going. And maybe I'll probably be able to go back to using New Hope. I can't say. Or probably stick with livestock. For now, I think livestock is, is okay. Yeah, so these are just the feeds I have used so far at my farm in the last two years. I have used hybrid, I have used New Hope, I have used Bridwell, I am currently using livestock. So this is not to tell you to use any feed. This is just me telling you the feeds I have used so far and how it has been for me. So let me know if you have used any of these feeds I mentioned, hybrid, new old, breed well, livestock, and let me know your experience with them. And also, if you've not used any of them, let me know what you feel about them also. Another feed that is so in my eyes right now is um, happy chicken. Yeah, there's been so, so much talk about happy chicken. Then also another one is ad, 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 adva or adiva. I think it's a very new one maybe in the last time um, it's a new one in the last two months so there's been so much talk about this i don't know if i'll be trying them but then of course i don't want to just be using different kinds of feed so that when i have an issue i want to know where it is coming from <laughs> like i said it's not to teach you anything but just to tell you my my thoughts or to let you know the feeds i have used so far so yeah thank you for watching so we we'll see you on another video Bye.